I'm going to show you how to fix RV variate error. So let's start. First of all, make sure to go to the launcher that you have the game on. Before you open it, you should go to the Windows taskbar, select this upside arrow. Now, if you do find the launcher appearing right here, you just need to right click on it and then select exit. Once done, for the next step, go to the search bar and type in device manager. Now, this will pop up. So search for display adapters right here and select this side arrow. It will open your graphics cards that you have installed. So do not select the integrated one, which is Intel or Ryzen. Most likely select the NVIDIA or AMD one, right click and select update driver. After that, do not select browse my computer for drivers. Select the first option and click on close. Go to the search and type in NVIDIA. Of course, if you do have an NVIDIA graphics card, Select the NVIDIA app or the AMD app depending on what graphics card you have. Now this will open so make sure to sign up with an account if you don't have one. Then go to the drivers icon appearing in the left menu. Click it and then select the install or download button in the right here. After that select express or custom installation and simply click on the continue button in order to update your driver. Now after doing that, go to the settings in the left menu. From here, you need to deselect or turn off the NVIDIA overlay. After that, go open the Steam Launcher or the launcher that you have the game on. So go to the left menu and select the view option and then click on library. From here, you need to look for the game. So once you select it, for example, you need to click on this gear icon appearing, which is manage and then select properties. Now what you need to do, go to the launch options command appearing right here and type in exactly like this dash dx11 once done go to installed files right here and then select verify integrity of game files that way any corrupted or missing file that is responsible for the issue will be safely fixed without the need to install the game from the start you just need to wait for the process to finish alternatively you should go to the windows icon go to settings now once done go to the left menu and select windows update after that make sure to select check for updates or download and install all of the updates if you do have any failed updates select retry all and if you are stuck on a loop you should just go to update history deselect the top sections you will find the uninstall updates and recovery buttons select the first one and then if you do know which update that is responsible for the issue you should just uninstall it from here otherwise go back select recovery after that click on reinstall now and that's it if you do find this video is helpful make sure to like and subscribe and see you on the next one